hundreds of Delta passengers stranded at JFK, furious over massive delays getting them from New York to Los Angeles. Flight 975 was meant to depart at 3.30, but weather and mechanical problems left passengers stranded on board the plane for hours, given only snacks and a bottle of water. The they gave us Cheez-Its, cookies, almonds, and they went around twice with waters. Forced to deplane twice, celebrity passengers taking to Twitter. Emma Slater of Dancing with the Stars saying they were eight hours on the tarmac, deplane twice, and no hotel vouchers given. Another tweeting, Delta, you're about to have a riot. At last, a food voucher handed out, but too late for the hungry hundreds. There's no food places open right now, so I don't know what they expect us to use the food vouchers for. And the tiniest passengers suffering too. No hotel voucher meant their night would be spent on an airport floor. I've been talking to passengers in the overnight hours. These are the pictures that they sent me, forced to sleep on the floor with the blankets that they were able to grab off the plane before they were deplaned for a second time. It looks like Delta may have violated the three-hour federal rule that prohibits them from keeping passengers on board the plane and on the tarmac for no more than three hours. They report being out there in total eight hours, both on and off. It looks like a weather delay, a pilot timing out, and even a, uh, a, a ramp worker who was run over by a luggage cart. They were having a moment of silence for that unfortunate man. This all led to this epic delay, which is going to stack up to about 18 hours, according to our calculations, if the flight leaves at 9 a.m. this morning. We're waiting to hear from Delta. We're live at JFK. I'm Kirsten Kolpix, 11 News. All right, Kirsten, thank you.